hey YouTube welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be all about skincare my skincare regimen and tips and tricks that I use to keep my skin clean clearly I have on makeup I'm aware of this um, so you can't see what my skin looks like I will be posting a picture of what my skin looks like obviously without makeup and a picture of what it looked like before I took care of my skin a bit of history about my skin um, I went through a spell in, uh, I think it was like 6th grade to ninth grade where I had broke out and it was like really bad. Like my sisters started a song about me. So regardless, so it, my my skin was really bad. I had really, really, really acne prone skin. Um, typical when you're going through puberty. Um, I did start a little bit earlier than most girls so I got it before most people. Um, so it was acne prone, it was oily, it was just really dysfunctional, I didn't really know what to do. Um, but we never. it really wasn't something like, oh my god, let's go to the dermatologist and see what we can do at your skin. It really wasn't that important. My, I don't really think my mom really thought it was a big deal, and at that time I didn't think it was a big deal either. I just knew that I had all these pimples on my face, people would make fun of me. Um, but I never was like to the point insecure that I feel like I needed to wear makeup because I didn't start wearing makeup until after I got out of high school but that's another story um, so anyway it was acne prone it was oily it was just a complete mess um, so then I went through high school and it got a lot better um, I would still break out around that time of the month as I still do now um, but it wasn't like as bad so then I graduated high school and I went to my first year of college <laughs> excuse me at a community college I was also in a relationship and my face just like broke out um, and I, I never understood why. And I was like, well, maybe it's because I was with a really crappy guy and he just made my skin break out. I don't know. So, um, but I had got acne again as an 18, 19 year old. And I was like, what? I'm not supposed to have acne now. And so I had got it and it was really bad. And I was going through cleanser after cleanser. And I just didn't know what to use on my skin. And I was like, oh my goodness. Um, and so then I started to change what I was doing. I started to eat better. I would say I started to eat a little bit better. Um, I stopped switching out products because a lot of the issue was is when I graduated high school that's when I got into makeup and that's when I was switching, I was changing and trying different foundations and trying different stuff on my face and so I think because of all the different changes my skin was going through that and what products I was putting on my face that was making me um, break out along with stress in school and stuff like that so it was just like everything was kind of piling up on me and it was coming out of my face I didn't drink a lot of water I ate a lot of junk food that also ties into good skincare um so I would say back in 2013 I had um, I had start I, I had ordered some skincare uh, products from a a, uh, a brand um, Herbalife. I started doing their skincare and it totally like flipped my skin around. So grateful for that. Um, I also started Herbalife and I was losing weight. I was eating right. I was drinking a lot of water. So because of that, my skin was getting better. So um, tips: <laughs> eat right and drink water, and that is going to make a big difference in what in your skin. Okay, so eat right and drink water and you also want to have good skincare products now um, I also had access to a lot of high-end um, skincare products because at the time I worked I started working at Ulta so I had got a lot of samples and got a lot of good things for my skin so I had a lot of I was putting a lot of good stuff on my skin along with like the Herbalife thing which I think I'm gonna do a separate video about Herbalife and what it is and how it changed my life and falling off of it and getting back on it. Anywho, another video. I know this is going to be a long video, sorry. So, here we are today um, with my skin and different products that I use and different things that I use. And so, um, it really, I really like the regimen that I have now. It does change periodically, but this is what I've been using for a couple months now. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and share it with y'all. Um, I have drugstore things in here. I have things that are expensive. I have things that are gifts. I just have all of it. Things, but they all work for my skin. What works for me might not work for you. So don't get excited if like there's a face wash that is in here that works for you for me, but doesn't work for you because everybody's skin is different. So also, I forgot this part. 
so I moved like I live in another I grew up in Texas well I grew up in California I moved to Texas when I was nine I lived in Texas from nine to 23 when I was 23 I moved to Oklahoma and so now I live in Oklahoma and the climate is very different from going from a humid climate to a dry climate and because I live in a different climate my skin is very different now it's not as oily anymore um, I think it's more drier or I think it's more combination it's like combination dry oily I don't it's very weird um, I don't really know how to describe my skin right now because it is very different it's I still get oily especially because it's getting warmer now but not as much as I used to um, so I'm gonna start with like my makeup removal because you want to have a good makeup removal system because if you don't remove your makeup well then obviously your skin is gonna I say eat it but it's gonna absorb it it's gonna get in your pores it's gonna be an SMS so I just use to remove my skin wow to remove my skin to remove my makeup, I use makeup wipes, and I don't use any specific kind. I've used a lot of different wipes before, but these, well, there's a third that I don't have anymore, but the ones that I'm going to show you are ones that I love using right now. Um, so this is the Equate um, Beauty, I think it's a Walmart brand, makeup remover cleansing palette. Oh, love these palettes. They work wonders. Um, this is just the travel packet because I was out of town and I ran out of makeup wipes. Um, so I just need to get to travel. So I picked up a couple of these. But I love these. They um, they get off all my makeup. My eye mascara. Like my eye makeup. They get all that off. I really, really like it. This isn't like the first and last step. This is the first step to removing your makeup, but it's not the last step. Like, you've got to do more. Like, I, I'm sorry, this is going to be a long video, but you can't just remove your makeup with a wipe. Like, it's still, you're just removing the surface. You're not even getting like into the pores, but we like this one. And then I got the Equate, the bigger ones. This is just the, um, the original clean wet cleansing towelettes it's both both by equate beauty this one has vitamin e in it removes makeup fresh clear skin i don't um this one just doesn't have vitamin e in it i actually like these better but i had a big pack of these but i wasn't going to take some trip but i had a big pack of these so i'm going to go through these and then um go on to another one another um other makeup wipes that i do like to use are by simple I love simple stuff. Um, eventually, I want to try all their products. Um, I actually have a product that you're going to show you, but I eventually want to try all their products. So anyway, so I remove my makeup with the makeup wipes, and then I go in with a cleanser. And there's two cleansers that I, I use, um, and it just gets the rest of the makeup off. The first one is the Biore, or the Biore. I think it's Biore. Um, Feel Free Deep Charcoal Cleanser Pores. And as you can see, I've used I've had, I've had this for a very long time, but um, I but you don't need a lot. It's really good. So I'm not even gonna squeeze out because I love stuff. I don't waste any. But it makes my face feel so tingly, and it draws out all my pore like the, it draws out the dirt from the pores, and it really just feels my face feeling fresh and really clean. And it also helps get the rest of my makeup off. So I really like this. Um, you can find this at any like any drugstore you can I, I got mine from Walgreens I think but you can get it from Target Walmart all these other places and then that's a cleanser that I use an exfoliator that I like to use is the apricot scrub and this is just the Walmart brand equate beauty equate beauty one and it's just a scrub um, it's St. Ives this is just the Walmart version of it I like to use this when I want to exfoliate my skin. Um, there's a there's better ones than this. I've had better ones than this. Um, this is just what I had got at the time, and I'm not gonna buy another one until I use this one. And I left my really good one at a hotel. But um, I really like it. Um, I actually was using this before I got my Biore one. I was using this as my cleanser, and. Um, it's just really good for exfoliating and sometimes I even like use it on my body too. It really helps to exfoliate. So I like that one. Um, so that's what I use for cleansing. For the days that I don't like to wash my face or like, for, like I don't wash my face like every single day because I don't wear makeup. But I also do like 
skincare too. So um, there's two products that I use. I used to, I used to use one, and I I resulted to the other one. So this one is um, witch hazel. It's like an astringent, like a toner. So I just get a cotton swab, roll over my face, and it gets off any extra dirt or anything um, because of. There's no point because water dries out your skin and so I don't want to like keep just washing my face with water that's going to dry it out. So I use something that's going to keep nutrients, keep moisture back in my face and put good stuff on my face. So I use witch hazel but I haven't used this in a very long time because I discovered this by Simple and this is the cleansing micellar water and it, it cleanses, removes makeup and hydrates. I don't use it to remove my makeup. I tried it doing once. I still had to go back and wash my face. So I just use it for like mornings or I like mornings that I'm not washing my face with water. Um, I use it for that same thing, cotton ball, cotton swab, put it all over my face. Um, even before, like if I do my makeup later in the day, I'll use this before I apply my makeup to make sure I have a clean canvas. I really like this. It's wonderful. Don't really know what's in it. It hasn't broken me out. It's it seems it's really good simple is for sensitive skin I want to say it's a natural line but don't quote me on that because I don't think it's completely natural but this stuff is wonderful and I really like it get it from any drugstore all the products that I'm showing you except three you can get four you can get from any five you can get from any drugstore um, so now let's get into moisturizers. So I have tons of moisturizers, tons of eye creams, but these are the ones that I've been using recently. So I've been using Pons recently, and um, my mom used to buy us Pons when I was a little, little girl. And I loved it, but I what I found out is it was it left my skin feeling really greasy. So it's, I think it's more for dry skin. All the, all the ones that I've seen and like read the bottom, bottle they said they were for dry skin I obviously don't have super dry skin but since I moved here to Oklahoma um, my skin has dried up just a little bit um, but this is still a little bit too too wet I don't know how to describe it it's too it's for dry skin so it's super super moisturizing um, so I just use very little of it but the funny thing about this, well, this is a travel size because I did just buy this when I was out of town a couple, like a week ago. But um, this is the anti wrinkle cream, whatever. <laughs> I've noticed I don't have wrinkles. Probably not going to get wrinkles. You can't prevent aging. You're going to get old. Um, preventing wrinkles is taking care of your skin. Anywho, um, and black don't crack noticed some firmness on my face with it when, once I started using it it felt really really firm and not tight but like firm and so I, it's obviously working like I didn't have a good but it like it like I don't know it like tightens the skin I think it's really cool so then for a night cream um, I use the seaweed night cream by Mario Badescu it's green I think it's really cool that it's green sometimes I feel like it leaves a green tint on my face but I use this um, this again is for dry skin but I do like it um, so I just use very little of it but what it does I do like it it leaves me feeling really refreshed um, honestly I can't tell you really what this does except leaves my skin really refreshed it doesn't break me out and you can see a difference in it like my skin is a lot softer in marriage since I started using this clearly I've used it a lot um, but I'm not a an esthetician so um, but it has some really good stuff in it and like I honestly would go to like an Ulta or Sephora and ask somebody who's like trained on this um, because I personally don't know too much about this brand so these are what I use daytime nighttime sometimes I use this for both it just kind of depends on what I want to do and then the last or well, last couple products oh yeah you another one that so moving on to eye creams I use an eye cream um, just because eye cream is something that you have to use and it works gradually over time it's not something that's gonna happen overnight and when I started using eye creams I just noticed the skin under my eye where was a lot softer and a lot more um, moisturized and so I like that and it just allows your makeup to apply under your eyes so much easier when you have a an I 
eye cream on. So um, this is It's Potent by Benefit, and it's a sample, obviously. It's like super tiny, like super tiny. Look, so um, I got this again at when I worked at Ulta, and I um I love it. I, I do like it. I don't like the smell of it. I haven't really seen a big difference of it. I do feel like it's a little brightening, so I feel like it makes my eyes just a little bit brighter. Um, but that's about it. I like the consistency of it. Um, it does leave my eyes hydrated, so. That's what I like about it. Um, and then another one that I use is by Herbalife. And this is the eye firming, the, the firming eye gel. Does the same thing. It firms, hydrates. I only need a little bit. But this is my favorite because it smells like, um, it smells like cucumbers. So it's like literally having cucumbers on your eyes. Um, so you have to order this. You can't order it online. You have to go through a distributor. Like I said, I'm going to do an Herbalife video about what it is and stuff like that. And then the last but not least thing that I like to do for my skin um, to keep it, you know, looking good and feeling right. Looking good and feeling right. Um, or last two things is I use this a mask. Um, not specifically just this mask, but I love masks. There is a mask. It's my favorite mask. It's by Herbalife. I just haven't ordered it. A very long time I might need to but this is the mask of Magna Minty and it's for face and body so this is what it looks like and I'm actually really upset guys this is what it looks like it's I have it it's full like this was this is 11 ounces and I probably used it four times they had a smaller size I should have got the smaller size I spent like 30 bucks on this and this expires on June 5th and tomorrow's June 1st so I'm really upset <sighs> I don't even know if I'm going to throw it out then, but we'll see. I don't know. But I suggest you just get a mask to help purge your skin, rejuvenate it, makes your skin feel good, especially you like mint. I love mint. Our mud masks are really good too. And then um, if I really feel like my skin is just really clogged and I just want it extra clean, I use my Clarisonic. This is just the Clarisonic Mia with one... Oh, it's like completely dead. That's funny. Oh no, I hope it didn't die for good. But one speed and just do it. I love this. I actually got this. My ex got this for me, but it works wonder. I really love it. So that was my skincare video. I know it was very long. I'm very long winded. Um, but those that's just kind of how I do my skin. Everything um that I that is in the video. Um, I will put in the down bar. I make sure I put in the down bar, the down, the down bar, down bar, the down bar. I'll make sure I put in the down bar. Um, rate, comment, subscribe. What's your skincare routine? What products do you use? What products are you more interested in? Do you want review? Like, what do you want? Um, so leave that down below. Like this video. Thumbs up. Subscribe to my page. Thank you so much to my subscribers that have stuck with me this long, even though I post a video like every other year. Um, and then to any new subscribers that I'm going to gain. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you on the next video. Bye, guys.